Under what circumstances do multiple convictions and sentences violate the Double Jeopardy Clause? We explore that question in Rutledge v. United States. Tommy Rutledge operated a criminal enterprise that distributed cocaine. The United States charged Rutledge with conducting a Continuing Criminal Enterprise, or CCE. The United States also charged Rutledge with conspiracy to distribute cocaine. The jury convicted on both counts, and the district court sentenced Rutledge to two concurrent life sentences without possible release. Rutledge appealed to the Seventh Circuit, arguing that conspiracy is a lesser-included offense of CCE. Accordingly, Rutledge reasoned that his convictions and sentences for both CCE and conspiracy constituted cumulative punishment for the same offense in violation of the Double Jeopardy Clause. The Seventh Circuit agreed that conspiracy is a lesser-included offense of CCE. However, the Seventh Circuit found that Rutledge's convictions and concurrent sentences were proper because his punishment didn't exceed the maximum allowed for CCE. The United States Supreme Court granted cert.